a show all about how Kate's life got twisted upside down. If you just take a moment and watch right here, her change into a chuggle will make you tear. In the town of Padua, born and raised in their castle is where they spent most of their day. Studying Latin and how to play the lute and also watching Kate act like a brute when a couple of guys, they were up in the hood, trying to win the heart of Bianca good. They got in one little fight and Baptista burst. You're gonna have to get my Kate wed first. Sergio, are you going to ask Vivi out soon? Yeah, but it has to be kept on the dumb though. Yeah, my dad can never know or he'll totally freak out. I need you to pretend to be my dad because my dad's totally embarrassing and Vivi will never boogie with me if she needs him. Alright man, sure I'll do it. He's here now, it's your time to shine! Ugh, took you long enough. Where's my son? Sorry, dude, your son doesn't live here. It's only me and my son, Lucentio, that live here. Thou liest. Lucentio is totally my son. How dare you try to impersonate me, you dweeb? Come hither, you rogue! I don't think you've met my dad yet. I'll explain everything later. Oh yes, hi. So fantabulous to finally meet you. So, I see you're reenacting scenes from Rocky Three again, Dad. What on planet Earth are you talking about? Get real with me, son. This maniac is trying to tell me he's your father. I think you should tell them the truth now. Fine, I'll tell them. No way, girlfriend. First, you have to tell me how outrageously awesome I am for bringing us to this party. Ha! No way, buddy boy. There's no way I'm doing that. Fine, suit yourself. The party will go on. We go, we you. Oh, fine. That's my girl. <laughs> the other day, I was pumping these hundred pounders at the gym, and I was pumping them like really hard. <laughs> Dude, that's nothing. Check it out, guys and girls. Keep your 100 pounders to yourself. You keep licking those little baby weights. You gotta impress Kate with these 200 pounders. Yeah, right. She doesn't even think you're rad. She's just in it for the popularity and she's too, she feels too bad to break up with you. And she doesn't even have the highest of standards either. Well, at least I'm not a poser and I didn't take Kate on our first date and not tell Baptista. And you. At least I'm not Kate's sloppy seconds. Now that's bogus. Ugh, who cares about your guys' stupid weights or anything? You guys are totally being lame. You guys are making this party so not fun. Let's go, girls. Sorry you're mad you have to stay with her just so that piece of can hook you up with that dream job of yours. Not my fault you chose, chose the bad sister either. Psych. She's actually super chill around me, and like we're totally into each other now. And she's way more rad than me. No way. Yeah, well, I'll bet you guys Bon Jovi tickets that she'll come back in and forgive me since she knows I love her. Your home girls are. You're on. If you lose, you give us your ride. There's no way she'll forgive you. You guys fight all the time. <clears throat> hey, little lady. Come back over here and feel my biceps that you love so much. They'll make you feel happy again. Buzz off. 
He that is giddy thinks the world turns around. Vivi, can you come back for a moment? I want to talk to you. I'm mad at you. Come on. Don't you want me? Here. Come, my sweet Kate. I want to apologize to you because I'm crazy for you. Hey, babe. Oh, girl, I'm totally sorry. Will you try and convince the girls to forgive these dweebs so we can totally get this party crunk again? I think you guys should totally forgive your boyfriends because they totally work out hard to impress us and they give us rides to these rad parties. And although they could be demi downers sometimes, they're just trying to show us off and they love us. They are just so great. Why are you acting like this? I totally thought you hated Petruccio and wanted to break up with him. Well, sis, one day I yelled at him and we got in a big fight and I was... He was so mad he didn't take me to eat and I realized I should appreciate him buying me food on dates and stuff like that and now we both respect each other and we have a rad relationship now. Let's bounce, Kate. Tranio just generously gave me his two front row tickets to Bon Jovi for tonight, and Hortensio let me have his two backstage passes. What? Sorry, babes. They didn't see this coming, but Kate is totally a chill girl now. Hi, guys. <laughs> I don't want to look at Nina, him. Nina, you have to look at him. <laughs> I don't want to look at him. Your line? Is that it? I don't know what my line is. What are you talking about? Well, I mean, okay, restart. It's hi. Oh, yes, hi. So fantabulous to finally meet you. Your guys' hand wasn't in the thing. <laughs> okay, Ooh. you can move the camera. <laughs> <up. laughs> yeah. It's funny. Nope. You say no, it comes out. No. 100 pounds to yourself. I forgot what it comes after that. Don't you want me, baby? Don't you want me? Come on. <laughs> it's okay, it's fine, you don't have And like that, now we both respect Jason, each other. your hand is in the camera. <laughs> what? Do it one more time, I don't think I got it. What? Look angry. <laughs> okay. Watch here. Come, my sweet Kate. I'm really sorry and I want to apologize because... I forgot. I think you guys should totally forgive your boyfriends because they totally work out hard. I think I already did this. <laughs> Roll credits.